In this video, I'm going to show you a crazy blitz that's going to absolutely bag any gun doubles, any 2x2 two two, uh, styles of sets. Now, if you guys don't know what gun doubles is, this is something that I think you're going to find some of the better spread players have been shifting to running gun doubles. And the reason why is because you get significantly better pass protection from gun doubles than you do from gun spread. And so I wanted to do a video on how you can absolutely scream at gun doubles, how we can slow down this offense. Uh, this is one of the offenses a lot of cfm guys like to run this and it's a really 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 good blitz about it so i'm excited to share this with you now if you're new to the channel be sure to subscribe also if you want to get my full 245 odd defense i'm talking about that today if you want to get the full 245 odd defensive ebook there uh, i would encourage you to sign up for the patreon now what the patreon is is it's unlimited access to every ebook every ebook update every exclusive tip that I release while your subscription is active. So you'll instantly gain access to the 11 eBooks that I've already released so far in the Madden 22 season. And I've got probably at least six more eBooks right off the top of my head that I'm working on uh, behind the scenes. So if you wanna get access to all that, the other really cool part about the Patreon is whenever we update an eBook, you will get that update as well. So we update these guides whenever we change something or tweak something. And so if you wanna get access to all of that, the Patreon is just 10 bucks a month, super affordable, super cheap, and I think it's the best way that you can get better at this game because eBooks will teach you how to think, they'll teach you concepts, schemes, game plans, and how to actually go about defending some of the best offenses in the game. So if you wanna learn it, again, I got four offenses and seven defenses, and the 245 odd is just one of the eBooks that we have. So that being said, if you wanna join the Patreon, there's a link down in the description of this video, so you can click that. Let's talk about pinch two and how this is going to bag gun double. So what we're going to do here, I'm just going to kind of illustrate the problem first and foremost. So if I just run this play like this, uh, what you're going to notice is the blitz is really not that good. Whenever you have an attached tight end, I find that it really makes this blitz significantly worse, especially if your linebacker is here. And again, the way two for five odd works especially if you have auto flip on is it's always going to put this slot corner where the slot receiver is so where gun doubles really has a significant advantage is that slot receiver really pulls that slot corner out there and this blitz just doesn't really work that well against gun doubles you see there it doesn't come in again so how can we make this blitz better well what i like to do and, and another thing that's really popular from gun doubles is this right here so let's just say they they, they may you know be aware that you might be sending this pressure well they're just going to streak this guy and throw an outside pass lead and it's really hard to guard that okay um, especially a lot of people what they like to do is they'll use her this guy right here well if they use her this guy it is in Madden 22 is very difficult to get out there and make a play on that ball okay so how do we deal with that how do we how do we blitz gun doubles and stop that slot streak well I'm glad you asked that because this is probably the best defense I have found for any kind of two by two set like this where you have a tight end on that side and here's what we're going to do we're going to uh, simply press coverage crash our line down we're going to then blitz this guy right here and we're going to qb contain i like to put that slot corner on a vertical hook we're not going to blitz him we're going to put this gun to qb contain move him here and we're going to stand right here now this is a really good gun doubles defense the reason why is because that blitz that wasn't getting any pressure before now just with one simple adjustment is going to get double edge pressure at the quarterback now the reason this is important is because if, for example, um, let's say they're trying to run a little bit of a bomb play. So they do something like this. You know, they're running like that, that deep post over the middle. That's kind of what they're going to go to. Again, the setup is really simple. If you want to just globally blitz the linebacker. So literally you come out, press, uh, crash line down, globally blitz linebackers, QB contain, take that slot guy, put him there. And then you're just moving that guy out and you're standing right here. Real simple, right? Real, real simple. You're basically the vertical hook defender on the right side. So if the tight end goes vertical, you need to go with him. But what you're going to see here is I'm actually going to block both my running back and my tight end. And oftentimes I'm going to get, I'm still going to get some pressure. Now I wasn't able to get pressure there. It's probably a bad alignment on my my part. Um, but let me show you again. So again, we're going to uh, put that slot corner in a vert hook. We're going to move this guy over here just like so, and we're going to stand kind of right in here, ideally. Uh, so that we can shoot the run if they run and then we can kind of come down against the pass So if they do this you see we come around and as you can see the pressures It's not coming completely clean in this video, but I will tell you there's a lot of times where that pressure will come completely clean um, 
Again, practicable could be a little fluky at times, but you're just trying to get this guy out of here. Okay, that's really the biggest thing. And then if you stay kind of right in here, or you know, kind of right in here, just trying to try to pull these guys out, you oftentimes will see that we're still gonna we're gonna get some good pressure. And even if we don't, they're still blocking seven. We got pretty good coverage, uh, pretty good coverage across the board. So you know, this is really the best thing that I have found, at least up till this point in the season, at being able to significantly you know bag something like a gun doubles, you know, this simple crash line here, um, you know, doing this right here. And, um, you know, to me, this is really, really good pressure, even though, again, we're only sitting five, they're blocking seven. Now, what most people are going to do is they're only going to block their running back or they're only going to block their tight end. So, for example, let's say they block their tight end, or I'm sorry, let's say, let me, sh let me see who I blocked here. But, um, again, you just kind of move this guy out just like so. And, again, you can kind of work on your placement. Your placement's going to determine everything. But let me just put the tight end on a route, and then we're going to block the running back, uh, which is very popular because most people don't like that you can't do a delay fade. If they block the running back, that can tame. Nine times out of ten, that can tame will get around the running back, and you'll be able to get uh, really good pressure just simple, simply doing that one little thing. So, you know, to me, this is my favorite way to defend uh, some type of gun double set. If they block the tight end, it's really – it's really risky. Um, most of the time, that contain is going to loop around the edge and come. But what I really like about this, again, it's a simple five out blitz. If they send five out, um, you know, they're really, we saw in the beginning, we weren't getting pressure. And then we go to this look right here. And now all of a sudden, we're going to be able to get, you know, normally double edge pressure, if not at least one person uh, coming completely clean at the quarterback. So that being said, guys, that's why I like this blitz so much. I think, you know, again, if you don't want to contain, uh, you don't have to. So you could just bring this guy out here like this. I like to contain. I think it helps the blitz. But if you want to, just make sure you get him in that blitz angle right there. And then now you've got kind of the same blitzing concept on both sides, which is really, really hard to pick up. So anyways, guys, that's the two, four, five odd stuff against the gun doubles. I think the gun doubles is one of the um, – I think gun doubles are two by two where they attach a tight end and running back there. I think that it's a really, really good way to attack the two, four, five odd. But now you have a blitz that you can use that keeps your streak, your slot streak taken away, and then just kind of leverages the power of that linebacker. So to me, this is a great, great, great way to use the two, four, five odd against this defense or against this offense. But if you want to learn the rest of the two, four, five odd, you want to learn the whole scheme and how it can work against the most effective offenses in Madden 22. I would really encourage you to join our Patreon. Our Patreon is just 10 bucks a month, and uh, you can cancel it whenever you want. But by joining the Patreon, you'll get unlimited access to every ebook that I release, including the 245 odd, which is already live over there. And um, we've already released 11 ebooks. We've got more on the way. So I think it's really the best place to get everything that you need in terms of schematics in the offenses or defenses. You're getting that instant access to all of it for just 10 bucks a month. So thanks for watching the video, and I would really encourage you to join the Patreon. There's a link in the description if you want to join. So just click that link, and we'll see you guys over at the Patreon.